Hello ladies and gentlemen and uh, I'm gonna show you how to install Dynico Plus on our virtual box. Uh, it is probably the smallest OS available in the Linux distributions. As you can see the size is only 75.5 MB and uh, you can use it as your daily driver. It, it doesn't matter. Uh, I'll be installing this OS. This is a 64 bit version. I'll be installing it on virtual box. So you just have to download the ISO and just follow the steps here in the video. So first of all, first of all, we wanna do, uh, make a new version bo machine. Uh, let me name it Tiny Two. Uh, since it is based on Oracle, so we will let the options run only. Okay. So next, I will set the base memory as 8000 MB because I am having a DDR4 uh, as host memory 12 GB memory card. Uh, let's read a new virtual, virtual hard disk. Select next. Next. Uh, since it is uh, the size is uh, very small, so we will create a 5GB hard disk. So, okay, create. Now let's press the uh, start button. Now select the ISO file you just downloaded to your desktop. Uh, here is the ISO file, the first one, Corpus 5.3.iso <coughs> Sorry So, let's select it and let's start Ok, so We are getting a lot of options here And uh, Let's choose the um, Is there any option to install? I guess no uh, let's take the first option only. Okay. So the OS now is now booting up. Okay, so we are here booted up with the OS. Uh, the size is so small, I guess. Okay, let's see at the control panel. Uh, services uh, uh, we are getting a basic UI here there are not a lot of many changes here in the version 5.3 but still uh, there are a lot of graphical improvements you can check out the official site for the change lock and uh, everything seems to work fine uh, you get a Wi-Fi application here you get a TC install you get a ISO burner you get a nice terminal window here so Quickly jump into the terminal. So let's change the password first. Okay, so we got a new password. Let's see how the how the memory is here. Uh, the memory is probably getting. Uh, not much more very used but still uh, not a lot of processes are actually using it the RAM usage is pretty low as compared to the OS so ok let's leave it uh, let's see the network and we got the network connections here uh, you can set it up later on I'll no, I won't do it you get the wallpaper here you can choose, like, uh, choose a various options of here uh, ok so this one is done this is the terminal server uh, this is the mount tool you can mount uh, dvd and cd images by this ok uh, you get the option of backup and restore you can backup and restore your files anytime to a hard disk maybe your external hard disk or, or to a pen drive it depends on you uh, we get a date and time here uh, you can select it most probably by all by your convenience uh, here is the here are the system states uh, as I said CPU memory memory is very low and the case size is pretty uh, good <laughs> and, uh, it's fine modules are not 
much but still it is okay for a 72 MB OS it looks good uh, there are not a lot of processes getting used here uh, I can see probably a, lo a small number of OS's here so that doesn't make much difference overall if you want to use it as a daily double it is recommended but there you won't get a lot of application support you won't be able to install many external third party applications so I guess it is not for the normal usage just for a developers only mm. I guess I have showed everything till now uh, editor control panel run program you can run programs okay okay It's stuck. I don't know why. Okay, so I'm shut uh, shutting it down. Uh, of course, probably there's nothing. There's nothing much to show in this OS. So I guess I will, I will be shutting down the OS. Yeah, one more thing. If you want more uh, uh, videos regarding uh, the OS, there are a lot of OS getting launched these days. Uh, maybe around i uh, i uh, went to the uh, distrowatch.com to see the available uh, linux distributions so i got a list of around 20 linux os's released this april maybe more than 20 so if you want me to review a particular os just drop uh, drop down a comment in the youtube uh, sections comment section below and i'll try to make a review as fast as possible so if you want more videos do subscribe to my channel give up a thumbs up and do share it with your friends if you like it very much do give do donate me some amount of bucks for my new phone okay so we are done thanks for watching please hit comment and subscribe my videos peace